Hello everyone. Welcome to the big picture. Let me give you a little bit of information about it. It's a online Bible study effectively. And this platform on YouTube is the repository for the videos that we record for the Bible study. But it's more than that also. It's a it's a, a, a looking into God's word from a dispensational point of view, from rightly dividing God's word. And the big picture is just the name that I've come up with to present the Bible study and also just any form of digging into God's word to extract truth, to look for truth in the right context. You'll see the timeline on the slide and a lot of the information that we deal with, the lessons that we deal with, is based on this timeline. We have a look at the various sections of time or dispensations or economies, as you want to call it. And we make sure that when we teach God's word, that we know where we are within the timelines, that we recognize that not all scripture is written for us, but there's certain portions of scripture that has been addressed to us and that we can receive that scripture and live it out and apply it to our lives. Particularly, of course, the scriptures written by the Apostle Paul during the mystery period, during the age of grace. All of the Bible can be learnt and in actual fact, by studying the whole Bible, we learn of God's plan. And again, coming back down to the whole reason why we call this the big picture is effectively it's a plan. It's a plan of God that has a starting point and an ending point. And if you think of any plan or project, it is divided up into sections to accommodate the process of achieving that plan. These sections within the plan don't necessarily relate to each other. If you think in terms of building a house, the foundation is a completely different process than building the walls or building the roof. And we cannot mix materials between the foundation and the walls and the roof. Otherwise, you end up with something that won't look like a house. And it's the same with God's word. We cannot take materials or verses or content from different dispensations in God's word and mix them together and expect to come out with anything useful. Because at the end of the day, although they all work together to, to bring God's great plan of redemption of humanity and the restoration of creation, they all work together to achieve that. But within a dispensation, we have to stay within the dispensation and not mix up the scriptures uh, and not mix up the timelines. Otherwise, you end up with confusion and contradictions that come through in God's word. So this channel, this Bible study, the videos that I plan to upload here, and also the blog that you see, the address of the blog that you see at the bottom there, is all the the content of the big picture, the material, the studies, the videos. I encourage you to visit the YouTube blog or the, uh, the, the, view, the YouTube videos or the blog. Uh, have a look at what's uh, available and um, join up as well. We have online Bible studies. You're welcome at any time to, to query about it, to ask about it, to join up. It's hosted on the Teams platform. And I encourage you to um, just dig in a little bit deeper, you know, see what we're all about. And uh, if, if anything grabs your attention, please feel free to contact me via this channel, via the blog, and I will be happy to provide you with more information to answer your questions. So uh, there we go. That is really what the big picture is. It's, it's really a Bible study and the whole purpose behind this channel and the blog and all the, if I can say, services that we offer is just to encourage you and edify you to study the scriptures for yourself, to dig in deeper, to extract the truth and to find out what God's plan is for you, 
what God's plan is for this age and what God's plan is for future events coming through. Thanks very much for joining me. Thanks very much for uh, praying for us. Thanks very much for joining up, right, and making the most of this platform. I will see you in videos to come and hopefully on the blog as well. God bless.